Okay, this here is the uh, Larisi XL Belly Band Holster. Um, this is how it came. Well, it came in a, a cardboard box, and then I took it out of the box, and then it looked exactly like this, and I haven't opened it. So I've had it actually for a few weeks, but uh, now I have the time to actually film it. So here we go. Now, even though there's a woman on the cover, this is also for men. So don't worry about that. That this this is for men also. This here, I believe, uh, is neoprene on this side, and this other side, it's not Velcro or nothing. I'm not sure what it is, but it feels good. It's a, it's a nice feeling. Now this is Velcro, so whatever this material is, it, uh, it attaches to the Velcro. So this is a pocket that comes off. Can put a few things in there, maybe credit cards or money or something. Okay, this here is uh, where the weapon goes in. And then on this side, there's two pockets here and on this side. I guess you can stick a magazine in there. You can stick a magazine on that side. Um, these here, I'll probably cut these off because I don't really like these retention things, but um, they're there in case you, you want to use them. All right, let's see how it looks with the weapon actually inside the pocket. Okay, there it is, and it's pretty snug. I mean, unless you're doing uh, jumping jacks or uh, cartwheels, I'm saying, it, unless you're doing cartwheels or something, this this uh, weapon will not fall out without the retainer with without the retaining strap. But it's in there pretty pretty tight. Also, you can notice here the trigger guard is completely covered. Trigger completely covered, so that's good. Anyway. That's it right there. Not too much to these belly bands. I like wearing these with shorts um, because when you try to wear a regular holster with shorts, uh, there's, for me, my shorts keep falling down. So belly bands the way to go when you're going to be wearing shorts. All right, then. Everybody take care. Uh, you know what? I had to make a quick correction. Um, as you just saw, I used the FN509 inside this Larisi. Um, belly band holster. Uh, yeah, it fits snug. The problem is because of the sights, if you can see, these are pretty large sights. Um, this gun is not good for this. Uh, 
trying to get it out is a bitch. <laughs> Especially if you have to actually use this to defend your life. Uh, that's not going to be any good. So, um, no. Uh, if you got a gun with kind of large sights like this, forget it. All right. So, let me see. All right. This here is the Ruger Security 9. And let me tell you something. This thing, this thing fits like a glove. I mean, I mean, this is... This is perfect. If you notice the sights, they're kind of low. This is exactly what this thing is for. So I'm going to throw this in here real quick. There it is. Perfect. And the weapon comes out really easy. Just like that. Now, don't get me wrong, when it's in there, uh, When it's in there, it's nice and snug. I mean, like I said, shouldn't be doing jumping jacks or wheel carts or any of that crap. But as long as you're standing upright, you're all right, this thing's going to be in there. But you need to take it out quick. Boom, just like that. Now, now you got these retention uh, straps here, so uh, for extra security so make sure that thing doesn't fall out um, these retention straps uh, work pretty good now I've been using this thing since the first part of the video you just saw that was actually a few months ago um, but I, I think I suggested I might cut these off or whatever but you know what I just kept them so uh, yeah I do use it actually I do actually use it now I have another belly band where I did actually cut off the straps and that other belly band works pretty good too but um, I decided just to keep uh, these retention straps. But remember, when you, when you uh, use retention straps like this, you got to train. Because when I first started using this, um, I would pull the gun out like, just to put it away. And I, for, I would forget that, the, that this strap was on. So I'm pulling and pulling. I'm like, oh, wow. So make sure you train uh, if you're going to use this uh, retention strap. So that way it's like second nature. Pull that sucker out and pull the gun out real quick. But anyway, but anyway, I've been using this and, and it works pretty darn good. It really does. It works pretty darn good. All right, that's it. Thanks.